Hey everyone, it is Neha with College Shortcuts. I hope you're having an amazing, amazing day. I know so many families are really getting stressed because August 1st is around the corner, and that means all applications are open to all colleges. And many people don't know this, but you can get your applications done early and literally find out from certain schools in September and October and November, way before deadlines. Now, some of my amazing, amazing clients uh, that have started with me in July are now completely wrapped up with the application process. That means we had gone through their list of schools, we had culled down that list to find the, really the perfect fit. And if you don't have someone looking objectively at your kid, it is so important to have someone come in and do that because you really need a third party opinion that's objective to see what would be the best fit that has a lot of knowledge about the different schools. The second thing we ended up doing was we worked together on what they're passionate about and what really fires them up every day and what makes them excited. And then we started looking at their resume, getting a sense of who they are, what their unique angle is, how to really create that am amazing admissions narrative. And then we brainstormed and then we drafted these beautiful essays. So now where I'm at today, and I, I know the last time I did this video, we had over 8,000 people watch this video. So I'm doing it again here today. Um, so I am, we've gone through that whole process. They've drafted all of their essays with our timelines and everything that we've set and literally got that whole section done in two weeks. Yes, you're right. Like literally in 10, let me turn my phone off. My phone always rings off the hook. Um, literally in 10 days, we did all of that process. So the last part of what we like to do is edit. So I've had my team actually, what's the best part when you work with us. And I put my phone number below. We've got account managers. Um, you know, the, the phones have been ringing off the hook for our college mastery program. So if it's something you are looking for and seeking, you should definitely call us. We've only got a few more slots left because, um, specifically so many people have been already reserving us out for next year and then also for this year too. So I'm going to go ahead and start doing what most people don't realize, but it's what I do a good portion of my time outside of when I do Facebook lives, when I'm uh, sending you guys lovely emails and so much. And today I posted an email about, um, you know, what it is that I exactly do. So if you're not on our email list, you want to go on collegeshortcuts.com and get that because we send some incredible information. So now what process I'm in with this student, the student's incredible. They're from Colorado, amazing, amazing uh, student. And what we're doing is, you know, I have a team of essay editors that go through and, and do all the uh, editing and, and also work with me one-on-one -on -one all together as a team to make sure that, you know, the student's essays really fit the admissions narrative that we had planned on. Um, now, the next step of what we're going to do here is um, we're specifically going to um, really take a look at those essays. And I'm going to be a little quiet here. But I'm going to take a look and see um, the, the essays back from my team again, because uh, I like to triple check everything. I think that's so important in the process. Um, and I'm going to take a look and let me see here. I'm going to put them all. So yeah, so I'm going to literally be editing essays right now, which a lot of people think is you know, interesting for me. I think it's fascinating. At least to see the finished product. So this student's got UT, UNC, UGA, Northwestern, UCLA, many different schools on their list. Um, so very excited to be looking through those specifically. You know, we make it as easy as we can for students because we really want to make sure that they put the right essays in the right document. Sounds simple, but you know, you'd be surprised. Sometimes people put the wrong essays. And you know, you wouldn't want that to happen. I've seen students do that. All right. 
Let's see, the team makes the dream work. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, hello. Oh my gosh, people are saying hi to me. Hey everyone, nice to see you guys. Oh my gosh, feel free to do thumbs up and little hearts and share with your friends. I love it. Oh my gosh, I just got another email about college consulting. Here's this mom, Griselda, that wants to hear from us. Cool. So if you guys reach out to us, just so you know, always leave a detailed message because we have a team that is ready to serve and make sure all families are taken care of right here, right now. Okay. Oh, gosh, this is like my favorite part of the day. Most people don't realize it. I, like, wake up in the morning. I do my morning meditation. I uh, Today I saw my aunt, which was really nice, and um, touched base with her. And then, you know, hung out with her a little bit early this morning. And then I had my little thing. I got my little morning shake here. And now I get to sit down and relax and do what I was born to do, which is work on essays. And a lot of people think it's so weird, but they're like, why do you enjoy that so much? I'm like, oh my God, it is so fun to see the finished product, you have no idea. All right, let's take a look here. Hi, Aracellus. Oh my gosh. So nice. You know what? If you reach out to me right now, I will forward you right over to my head account manager. Shoot me an email or just call the number. Actually, just call the number, guys. If you don't get a hold of someone because we've got so many parents, you know, 10,000 people are like reading our stuff at least on Facebook and over 50,000 through email. Please go ahead and leave a voicemail. Just so you know, we check every voicemail. Yeah, I know voicemail sounds outdated. I don't think it's outdated. I love voicemails. Just a heads up. I like voicemail more than texting. <laughs> Anyways. If people only knew how old school I was, they'd probably freak out. Okay. So just some background, this kid, it's really fascinating. They had hired another consultant. They had started with in February, three months in, all they had was a resume and sort of a list of schools. So this mom had found me online and was like, oh my God, I feel like there's a reason why I found you online. And, you know, I followed up with her and we ended up working together. We got this done in like literally 12 days. She was like, I didn't believe you when you said it. And I was like, I know most people don't. And that's okay. And so now we're in the final stages, way before deadline. You know, it's just so nice to get that out of the way. Look, your kids are going to leave home, and you want them to have a good time in this process. This is your last real bonding experience. Make this to be fun. That's what I think, personally. I think it should be a wonderful experience. Okay, let's take a look here. Oh, thank you. Aracellus ordered my little cute uh, essay report, which is so sweet. I love that. I really appreciate that. You know, you guys really know how to make my day, too. Sometimes when you're an entrepreneur, it's just like nonstop, nonstop in your own little world of like working and trying to make a difference and all of that. And so when I get, when I get, when I hear from you guys like positive stuff, it's so nice. You'd be floored to know how many haters I have. It's, I get really mean emails, even from the emails I sent. I'm like, guys. I'm changing kids' lives. I'm not doing brain surgery. All right, don't get so mad at me. But here's the last you just made my day. Okay.
So what I'm doing right now is I'm adding in a little bit more to what my team has already done. They've already done a phenomenal job. I wish I could share my screen with you guys, but this is confidential information because it's a student's profile. Um, <clears throat> but we're working on their main Common App essay right now. So I always like to look back at like the old draft of the student, look at the new edited draft, and then add my own touch to it as well. So that's why, you know, this is why it takes time to do this process. You guys are really gonna enjoy this video. <laughs> It's actually really hard to read this essay. The student has gone through something extremely challenging. And the frustrating part about it is I know this student personally because I work with them and my team works with them. And it's so frustrating to hear some of the, the hardships students have gone through because no child deserves to be bullied or hurt or frustrated or, or dealing with these types of things. But when we work on essays, we find certain topics that really showcase their transformation. But it's hard to reread it again. It like it like hurts my heart a little bit. Yes, I type that fast. Uh huh. I'm going to lose a minute, guys. Should I go out and ask him? <laughs> Thanks, guys. <laughs> Thank God for spell check, right, guys? Everyone who likes spell check, give me a heart or a thumbs up. <laughs> Also, if you like these videos, hit the get notification, guys. It's always a great way, too. That sentence is not needed. Oh, hi, Lagaya. Nice to see you. Yes, that's exactly what I do. Maybe I'll do a little text for you guys. Let's see. I'm going to create a new text overlay for you guys. Working on college admissions. Essays. I know. Looks like it's from the nineties. The best I can do. <laughs>
Oh my gosh, I'm getting a phone call. Decline. Oh my goodness. That's what my day is like. I get called constantly. All the time. All day long. <clears throat> so, Lagaya, yeah, November is your deadline, but that doesn't mean that's when you should start working. <clears throat> I'm all about no stress, no anxiety, get things done early. This student's applications aren't due technically till November, December, but it's July, what, 27th, and we're already done? So, <clears throat> get it off your plate. That's what I, I'm all about, getting stuff off my plate. I love getting stuff off my plate. All right, let's see. Let's see, Maya. Yeah, well, guy, go ahead and reach out to my team. I know you're asking a lot of questions. But, um, yeah, my team would absolutely be able to help uh, answer the questions you're asking about uh, the deadlines and the questions. Yes, every application you do, whether it's grad school, med school, MBA, undergrad, all of them are going to have specific questions but it's about taking the time to brainstorm and strategize around it. That is so important. Uh, and that's where I really come in to make sure my team helps with that. All right, let's take a look. Staying organized in this process is so important. I like taking moments to make sure they're fully organized prior to just, you know, editing because everything needs to be in the right place. Otherwise, it's just such a problem later on. Oh, look, Gaia, getting into grad school isn't hard. It's just a system and process. It's so easy. 
And yes, letters of recommendation, GPA, rec- all that stuff. Yes, that's the easy part. But the essay is the part that really matters. So you need to make sure that you get that handled. And just, you know, we've only got a few slots left. I mean, we're literally, I mean, if you're not getting us, it's because our, our phones are ringing off the hook because we just, we're only taking on a certain amount of students and then we close up. We'll probably close up shop on, probably in the next three weeks, we'll stop accepting students for this school year because we're already booking out for next year. So just so you know, if you're thinking about it, this is the time to do it. Okay, let me take a look here. Yeah, look, I have, there's a phone number below, um, and I have someone who's totally ready to answer exactly how we work in our whole process. So go ahead and call 713-401-2867, and if you don't get an answer, just leave a voicemail, and one of my account managers can absolutely help you with all the questions you have, because they would love to sit down and walk you through how we work. This paragraph needs to move here. Oh man, this is a thick essay. 600 words, guys. Of course, Lagaya, I love you. No worries. Can't wait to help you guys. You guys are the reason I exist. Ah, heart to you too! Oh, you guys are so amazing. Would love to do a shout out. If you know any family that needs help, please give them my number. We are very, very focused on helping as many families as we can. Beautiful. That paragraph is beautiful. You know what the biggest thing about editing is, guys, is that 
You have to always make sure that the child or the student's voice is always kept intact. And it's hard sometimes. You know, a lot of counselors or consultants, they'll change up everything. And then your essay is totally different. I mean, it takes a very skilled expert to make sure everything hurts. Everything is, you know, still a level of what they're wanting, you know, to really say their voice as. It's such a problem that I see over and over. So right now, just, you know, I am working on a main 600 word essay and it takes time to make sure it's absolutely perfect. You need to reorganize it. Sometimes sentences like should be somewhere else just based on what's being said. Most people think of You know where students really struggle? Transition sentences. It's like you go from like paragraph to paragraph to paragraph and you're like, wait, how does this tie together? It's all good. So I'm trying to write this like little transition piece to make sure this all goes beautifully together. And I like to do it a few times before it gets perfect. It's like a painting. You know what I'm like? I'm like Picasso for college consulting. Picasso essay editor. I typed too fast for the internet. <laughs> my screen took a moment to catch up to my words. Although this seems like a simple act, it impacted this entire day. The same.
Mm. Oh, it's a good one. It's a good one. That was good. Oh, so good. Amazing, we don't have typewriters anymore. Do you know how hard this would be if you were doing this on a typewriter? Oh my god, we are so lucky we have things that can edit and spell jack. It's just powerful. Lots of messages. Oh, talk to you guys later. Oh, such a good essay. Let's see how many words it is. Mm, might be too many words. Let's see. Word count. Ah, got to get rid of 42 words. All right, let's try this again. At least it's done now, right? It's like, okay. Hey, Beth. Beth, are you Elvis? Is Elvis listening to me? Ha! <laughs> so cool! Most people think of this as cop out for myself. It was a way to save my life. Oh, that's even better. I need to stop adding words though, right? The whole point was to cut words, and I'm like, mm. <clears throat> We'll put that sentence later. As a victim of the I'll put you guys here if it's more better to see me like this instead. Yeah, okay. Alright. Wow, I've been live 35 minutes. You can see how long it takes. People think like editing essays is the easiest part. This is just me doing a touch on it. We have other readers that read it prior to me doing it. We spend like like gobs of hours before we get to a final draft. <laughs> Most parents are like, give me the essays back. I'm like, guys, we're we're still in editing mode. Like it's not something you can just do overnight. You need like you do it and then you spend another day and you reread it and you spend another day and you reread it and then it's done. It takes at least three or five days at minimum. And that doesn't include the dra drafting and brainstorming coming up with to write with. I'm just talking about editing. It's kind of like when you write a book. I'm writing, I'm just finished my third book. I, I now have the edited one for my editor. Even myself, when I do my own writing, I get it edited, right? Because you can't see it yourself when you write at all, like the things you need to see. Someone else reads it, they're like, ah, oh, that sentence is not good. Um, so, yeah. Anyways. Okay.
now I encourage my friends and let me get that and others period that's an additional transitional phrase it's not needed I went from from No comma there. Oh, I love that sentence. Woke up with a smile. So good. If you guys can see this, it's so good. I'm gonna look at the resume to see. Let me see the resume and see if there's something more. I move too fast sometimes and Google Docs freezes, like as if it just can't keep up with my speed. Does anyone hate the fact that internet is like this sometimes? The funny part is, I remember this sound. Anyone remember this sound? Yeah. Dial up. And I'm still complaining. That's the funny part. I'm like, really? Really? I find this, like, challenging. It kind of cracks me up a little bit. Okay. Sometimes I think my computer is haunted. Because of how slow it is sometimes. Sometimes I'm like, I really need to get a new computer, but I love the one I have. It's so hard. So hard, because I really love my computer. All the beautiful things I've done is on it. Okay, all right. Almost done with this one essay. Okay, here we go.
Okay, I put one sentence in because I have to delete 42-ish words, so it helps. sentence. Oh, these sentences are so good. Oh my god, I love it. Oh, I love that sentence. Sorry guys, this is this is what you call really nerding it out. I know I'm I'm most people don't realize I'm like head nerd of college shortcuts. This is like what I love to do. It's my favorite thing in the world. All right, where are we at? I don't think I cut enough words. Ooh! I did! Oh my god, I should get a gold star right here! Sweet. Yes! One essay done. <laughs> you guys are probably like, wow, that's a lot of excitement for essay editing. No, it's a big deal. This is like a really good essay! Okay, all right. <clears throat> Next one. This is what I call marathons. <laughs> I like to see who's really going to be able to stay this long to watch me do this for this long. Because most people don't have the stamina to do what I do. <laughs> like, it's very intense. Um, yeah. Okay, here we go. What are you interested in and why? Oh, yeah. Hmm. 
Hmm. Wow, that's a lot of money they got to invest. Hold on, is this real money? Um, I think it was fake money. I hope so.
Sometimes I like to copy and paste from other essays as well. Oh, a lot of people are logging in. Hi, everyone. This is Neha with College Shortcuts. I am spending my wonderful morning um, editing essays right now. Right now I'm working on a student's essay, their second one. Uh, that is a nice, hefty, long essay, and I am editing. I put my phone number below if you want to call me, maybe. And uh, if you are looking for help, we've got just a few slots left for this school year. And then, of course, we're booking out for next year for um, parents that want us to make their kids' dreams come true with college essays and the whole process. So if you have any questions about that, call the number. I've got account managers ready to go that can absolutely answer your questions. Now, remember, we have only one line. So... If you don't get us, you just have to leave a voicemail, and we will absolutely call you. We track every call that comes in because we want to help as many families as we can based on what we have uh, in helping. So, hi, everyone. Say hi back. I love it when you guys are here. So nice. Sometimes when you're editing, it feels so lonely. You're, like, in your own little world. So that's why I like to turn this on so you guys can see. Like, this is what a lot of what we do uh, <clears throat> behind the scenes is like at College Shortcuts. All right. But this is a good one. Let's see how many words we're at. Sometimes I like to really hit up against word count, and I should be like, all right, could I add more? I mean, more! You know, but it's like, all right, that's enough. You know what I mean? That's enough! No more! Um... Okay, this one looks good. I should make sure all the font colors the same. See how the font colors get changed. My two months colors. There we go. All right, now I'm going to do a final run through on this second essay. This one was already really good, so I don't have to add too much. Uh, what you're interested in and why is like to me one of the easiest prompts out of uh, a lot of the ones because <clears throat> it's not asking that hard of a question in my opinion, um, but. It does take time. It was funny. My cousin was like, hey, Neha, I'm applying to MBA school. Can you, like, help me with my essays? And I was like, of course. So I had my team help out. Um, um, Okay, right. sorry, I seem to have to respond to messages because, like, otherwise I can get, like, sucked into my own little world, and then people are like, are you dead? Where are you? I'm like, okay, Mom, calm down. Still, still, she's worried. I'm like, Mom, watch my Facebook Live. <clears throat> I can get into a whole 
tirade about moms. Indian moms specifically, but I won't. Okay, let me finish this one that say now. We'd love to say hi to you guys. I see you guys on, by the way. I see you're on. Say hello. I love it. Okay. Decision to embark on Oh, yeah, let me make sure all paragraphs are indented perfectly. Okay, cool, yeah. This time I looked at it as an opportunity. Talk to one of them. and input. Oops, the L moved. Put the L back on arrival. Whoops. <clears throat> this is what I'm going to do, but when you're trying to charge, charging, I don't know. It's important to make sure This is going to help create a business. Answer space. Ooh. All right. Beautiful. Oh, so good. Oh my God, it's so good. Okay. <laughs> Sorry, guys. This is what excites me. <laughs> you guys might get excited about other things, like, I don't know, teenagers get excited about the Kardashians or Snapchat filters. Moms get excited if they get 20 minutes of silence. For me, it's a good essay. Everyone's got their own little vice. For me, it's editing essays and making sure they're awesome. Additions go to the business courses at school. Boom. Party. That one is a done deal. Dunzo. Awesome-o. Ha. Ah. Feels so good when it's done. All right. Mm. Let's edit the title. What's the date today? 
27. Done. All right. Okay, guys, I'm going to take a bit of a break. That was one college application. If you're wanting help, we have a few slots left. Just a few, guys. So go ahead and call us, 713-401-2867. So excited to be getting done way before even applications open. You don't have to wait till deadlines. Who cares about the deadlines? Get them done now. So much more fun. All right, guys. Thanks for joining in. Good to see you. I hope you guys reach out to me. I know, Lagaya, you were reaching out. Awesome. Please do. Aracelis, please reach out soon, guys. We're going to be closing up in the next two weeks because we've got so many requests. So go ahead and let me know. We are hitting capacity of how much we can edit. So don't forget to reach out. Mwah! Love each of, each of you guys. Okay, bye.